hey y'all welcome back to my channel the bfx so as you can see by the title i am definitely moving on so basically i quit my job i know i know it's crazy you're in a pandemic blah, blah, blah. well you know let me tell you the let me tell you what's tape basically um the office manager was like oh i don't feel like you're doing enough da, da, da. and basically let me tell y'all i go to work from like 8 8 30 because there's not a set time the first patient comes around like 9 so 8 8 30 get my you know chart prepped up and i even stay later because it's supposed to leave at 5 i had to be staying till like 5 30 6 you know put in my work in but it's like so much work that I have to put into the system manually and it's like okay you want me and you don't pay me overtime so I'm, I'm watching my hours not you know trying to go over my time because I'm only allotted 40 hours a week right they, if you go over there 40 hours you don't see a dime more so it's like okay I'm watching my hours and a lot of time you're like okay i'm trying to get everything done manually you know get my stuff together and you know i don't have time to do everything so like next morning i'm backed up already but it's like okay if i don't have time to do it i'll do it after i'll try to stay after and i was like okay that's not working so i'm just like okay i'm gonna do what i can in the time y'all give me because if i'm not getting paid more to stay extra time i'm not gonna do that I'm not gonna kill myself for y'all y'all being cheap like it was crazy but i was like okay whatever um she was like yeah you're not doing enough we need to do i told her i was like you know um it's a lot you know that's why the last person wasn't the last person just gave up like before me the last person just gave up and you know they got fired whatever i never got fired a day in my life i've been working since i was like 15 16 and I never got fired. I was left a job for better, like literally. Every job I moved on from, it was either better, better benefits, better pay, better hours, like whatever. It was always better. So I came to this job because I wasn't working at all because, you know, pandemic. And I came to this job because, you know, it was like hard finding a job because a lot of business are closing. So I came to this job, came to the countryside. I love the countryside, like, love it. But the job is like, okay. It was like stressing me out a little bit. I was like down a little bit and I was like, oh my God, you know, what am I doing? Started praying more because I was like, Lord, I just need guidance, you know, like what am I doing? And I was like, okay. And then the office manager, she, because my sister's the nurse practitioner. So she, once my sister, she was like, oh, um, talk to your sister and whatever. She's, she's going to get replaced. Like we're, we're going to replace her. I was like, okay. She, t My sister told me, but my sister told her that she wasn't going to do her dirty work for her. So if they wanted to fire me, it had to come out the office manager's mouth, right? Right. So my sister was like, this is what she told me, but don't act on nothing. Don't say nothing. So knowing me, I was like, oh, really? Because when she was in my face, she was like, what can we do to make it better for you to work in? Whatever, whatever, right? But that same day, before she even said said that, she sent the text. My sister showed me the text of where she, the lady told her that they were going to replace me, right? Because they have a replacement, whatever, right? Who, let me tell you how God works. So she told me, my sister told me that. And then um, the next day I went to work and the lady was here. He, he's smiling in my face. Hey, Lana, how you doing? Good morning. I was like, weird. Like, you weird. You mad weird. Like, what? okay whatever so i was like mm -hmm. you know keep it cute and I kept it pushing so that happened i started you know applying for jobs i was like you know praying for guidance whatever and god was literally telling me you know it ain't it i got better for you and i was like okay whatever i'm gonna put my two weeks in before you know they find their replacement or before they fire me where whatever would have came first right so um yeah so yeah so i was writing my two weeks in or whatever and god told me of where he wants me to move to and i was like what i'm moving again i'm moving i was like yeah you're moving and this is where i want you to go 
I'm not gonna tell y'all in this video. <laughs> and this, he would say, yeah, this is where I want you to go, right? And I was like, why? Okay, so I put my two weeks in, started looking for jobs in that area um, and everything. And I was like, okay, okay, like things are coming together. Like I'm getting signs, I'm getting like, I'm having dreams about this place. I'm like, okay. And everyone that, you know, that was around me speaking of that place they were like oh my gosh you're gonna love it there i loved it there they're like ah, i wish i could go back this and that oh if you're going to be in that area um let me know which area you're moving into and i'll uh, put in some words for you i'm like oh okay i see god because specifically in my prayer i was like lord um if this is the move for me clear a path for me i said the, the job that you want me to work um the job that you want me to work in please let it be clear to me and everything like you know being really specific i was like lord i don't want to be you know overworked and underpaid this and that and the jobs that are you know getting back to me because i went on indeed i was like okay and i did um i was also doing staffing agencies also so because they said in that area you know staffing agency is the best so staffing agency i was going through you know um wasn't that best wasn't the best but indeed i was getting a lot of feedback i was getting a lot of like okay okay cool 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 okay so now i was like and that's that for that that's another video that's yeah that's gonna be for another video but yeah i was very specific in the prayer and i put i wrote in my two weeks and their replacement for me backed out like they didn't want the job anymore they were like what you want me to do what and pay me how much no i'm not doing that so they're like oh my gosh they're in a bundle like they're in a bind right now oh um can you stay an extra week until we find a replacement i was like how y'all was gonna fire me and now you want me back that don't make no sense it's okay god already moving forward and past y'all right now i'm not even on y'all level no more like i'm moving up and they were like i didn't say that of course because i would have been like crazy but maybe i should have but you know i'm not crazy but you know they were like oh um we need you we want you to stay why are you leaving us da, da, da. i'm like why everyone acting lost when y'all were talking about me y'all were talking about replacing me how y'all talking about me and talk about replacing me and and y'all want me back to stay in i don't like toxic environments if an environment or someone's toxic i don't want to be around that i don't like being around those types of situations i don't entertain those situations so i was like no it's okay you know um i can like for me i just stayed that additional day because they ended up finding someone that was not experienced so basically um i'm saying that an additional day to just you know teach that person which is like yeah to teach that person only and that's it and i hope that person can grasp it in one day because it ain't like it took me two weeks to grasp everything and get right on track i didn't know how to do blood pressure i didn't know how to do none of that like i was like whatever so i knew how to i know how to do everything now they like how i do it you know and you know i was like and in all reality you know, don't mess with God's children. Just do not do that. Yes, I'm Christian. No, I'm not perfect. But don't mess with God's children because you do. You they did all of that for what? They did all of that for what? Now they they won't be complaining about that new girl because ain't no way she gonna grasp all of that. Grasp all of that information in one day. It's a lot of information. It's a lot of passwords. A lot of logins. All of that it's crazy it's crazy but you know that's it um my next video y'all stay tuned because i know y'all don't want to miss this so y'all better subscribe like and comment so i want y'all to comment where y'all think i'm moving to in the first two people i'll cash at ten dollars to the first two people who get it right all right